Mike Mutiaba was was a, was a born again, born in Masaka by uh, uh, Mr. Serunjoji Robert and Nakazi Josephine. I used to go and watch uh, a couple of games uh, in uh, in Masaka Recreation Center, whereby uh, Villa there was a big game that me and my dad uh, went to watch was against. Uh, on against Express, Express and Vera. Many people got to know me when I was playing for St. Mary's, Standard High School, Zana, and Bunamwaya, but I began playing way back when I played for the, the junior team of Express called Wembele, and there was a, a first division team I played for was called Kisanja. That team was owned by uh, uh, Sebuliba. It's been a long journey, as, 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 as you've said. Um, but uh, it has always been hard work. My best moment was um, was when I, I got the, the first transfer to Elmo. Oh. The worst moment was against um, was when we played against Kenya in Nambole when we failed to, to qualify to the Afcon, and during that game I missed uh, an open chance. I'm just proud and. Uh, it's, it's, it's every, every player's um, a dream to play for the national team and uh, it's been my, my dream to play for the national team again. I feel happy and of course, of course I'm planning to continue with football. It is hard to, to go from football completely. When I retire I'm, I'm hoping to, to start a, a coaching career. In the beginning, I just went to KCC for training, just like for personal training, to have maybe kick a ball around, something like this. Uh, but as time went on, they saw that maybe I still had some potential to play. And um, so Coach Mike approached me and asked me, hey man, would you still want to play football? I said, yeah, if, if I told them given an opportunity, I can still play. If you work with Mike, you get to understand him well or better. He's one, he's one guy who doesn't, who doesn't have people's time. You know, he's professional enough. Uh, you just have to do what you have to do. And if you do what you have to do, there will never be a problem. Uh, to me, it was quite, uh, quite easy because uh, they have a, 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 a style of play that they really like. You know, they like, they like players who always handle ball well who always want to, to like to take on players i was going through a hard time uh, whereby i was um i was always um, getting injuries uh, injury after an injury injury after an injury so i reached a moment and i said why don't i hang up my boots because even if i i play for a month the next month i'll be injured you know of course, I can't compare Ugandan football to any other country. Uh, uh, um, to any other uh, country, uh, Ugandan football is. We still have a long way to go. Some uh, the wages here are, 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 are too low. Honestly, I can even retire tomorrow. I I don't have it. I'm just playing for for passion. <laughs>